Hey guys and welcome back to another haul video. I feel like this channel has been pretty heavy on the haul front lately um, so do excuse that. I have obviously been away and doing a bit of shopping but I've also been doing some shopping for my summer holidays and River's summer holidays. River's first um, it's like summer family holiday is coming up. We've actually got two different trips. One is for um, a really good friend of mine's wedding this week and then we're going away again in like another week after that so it's like a it's like a half a week after that no a week and a half even <laughs> my brain is frazzled today my t-shirt says give me a break and i think that just sums up today i'm filming this on monday and it's like where is my brain even gone anyway so we're going away on a trip to italy for a wedding and then we're going on our like family summer holiday to portugal and i'm so excited to be taking her away so not the first time we've flown with her because we went skiing although not really skiing we kind of just took her with us um and um in february if you guys remember if you follow me on instagram you'll have seen that um but she was super super tiny then so this is like her first kind of proper holiday where she's gonna be um playing and just she'll be able to actually be aware of where she is and everything so well to, to a certain extent to a certain extent uh, but we're really excited anyway so i thought i would show you a few of the things i picked up for her both for the trips and just for summer in general she's now five months old so she's got to that awkward size where she's just growing out of three to six month clothing into six to nine but depending on the brand like a lot of her three to six stuff will still fit and then a lot of it is way too small and she's into six to nine and yeah so she's in that awkward stage where um a lot of her clothes are too small for her and she's kind of having to transition her wardrobe again for the second time because she obviously did it in the naught to three to three to six um but i bought some really really adorable summer things obviously the weather here has been really warm as well so she's been able to wear a lot of them already and hopefully we'll get some good weather this summer and she'll be able to wear a lot of them throughout the whole summer so starting off with Gap stuff, there's actually supposed to be a few more things from Gap because I ordered another bunch of stuff on the internet when they had, they had like 40% off everything during um, the Royal Wedding weekend. So I ordered a few more things from her from there because Gap this season for kids I think is adorable. Baby Gap have absolutely nailed it. And the first thing I bought, I bought two things when I was away actually um, and she already has these in denim, which I would have shown you, but they're in the wash um, because she wears them a lot. But I got these little shorts in white as well. She already had the denim ones and I knew I loved them. They're super cute. They've got these little scalloped pockets. They're really comfortable. A lot of the time with baby clothes, I find the waistbands are really tight and that makes them feel like they're not that comfortable for her. But these are on the bigger size of 0 to 3. So I got them, no, 3 to 6 even. She's not, no way is she in 0 to 3. These are on the bigger size of 3 to 6. So I got them in 3 to 6 and they're definitely going to fit her for a couple more months because they're really quite loose. Um, really comfortable. The white ones are very lightweight. The denim ones are like a light denim, but they're still much heavier than the white ones. But um, I feel like these will go with a lot in the summer and they're really good for like putting under little dresses and stuff too so she doesn't flash her knickers at everybody or nappy at everybody. Um, and then I also picked up this hat. This is my favourite baby hat that I've found. I bought one from Next as well a while ago and... It... Is that waking up or is that just groaning in your sleep ribs? Please don't wake up now. You only just went to sleep. Okay, fingers crossed we're good for a little while. She's still like half asleep. Um, so yeah, this was my favourite hat that I could find. I bought one from Next. Like I said, um, a little bit earlier in the summer, it just kept falling off because it didn't have an under chin strap. This one has a wider brim as well, so it actually shades her. I feel like this is not gonna give you a good representation of what it looks like, but um, it's really cute. And yeah, so that was from Gap as well. And then also a few weeks ago when I bought the denim shorts, I also bought this, which is a little mint cardigan. I actually got this in six to 12 months and I put it on her now, I just roll the sleeves up. I think with cardigans I always buy a size up so that you get more wear out of them because you never, well I never really do them up. I just kind of roll the sleeves up and then yeah you actually get like six months wear as opposed to, or probably four or five months wear as opposed to three months. So um, yeah I just love the mint green of this, she's worn it absolutely loads. And then I also 
bought this, which if you guys watched my last vlog video, um, I think it's gonna go up before this video, I finished it last night, um, you'll have seen me stitching this up because it's actually had a hole in it when I bought it and I haven't had the time to take it back, so I've stitched it up. So yeah, I really love this little romper, even though it had a hole in it um, and I had to stitch it up, it's just the most adorable little thing. I actually did get this in three to six and it fits her perfectly now. And it looks so cute. You might have seen this if you've seen my Instagram stories in the last couple of weeks. Because I've put her in it a few times and she's just, it's so cute. And I love little rompers like this that have the poppers on the bottom. Because they're just so easy to change their nappy. They're so comfortable for the baby. They can kick around as much as they like. And they're not like constantly having like a dress coming up their back and stuff when they're in um, like their car seat or whatever. They're just really comfy and nice. It's really lightweight, cotton. I really love this a lot. A lot, a lot. So that's what I got from Gap. Like I said before, I have also ordered like a swimsuit and a couple of dresses, but they haven't arrived yet. Next up, I got a few things from TK Maxx. TK Maxx baby is really hit and miss. I always go in there and I like scour the rails. My top tip in there is if you have a girl or, a, or vice versa or a boy, make sure you check the boys section or the girls section as well, because I always find the best things for River in the boys section. Um, a lot of the time they get mixed up and or also the clearance there's usually really good stuff in the clearance um, but also like I very much dress River quite like non pinky and fairly gender neutral um, apart from these <laughs> um, but I always find that a lot of the like more unisex stuff they always put in the boy section for some reason so anyway I got her two pairs of baby sunglasses the first ones are these pink ones which I wasn't sure about I was with my mum and my mum was like they are so cute you have to get them um baby sunglasses are really hard to find nice ones and I just she gets really bothered by sunshine in her eyes like if you're walking in a buggy and it like the sunshade isn't quite far enough to like shade her eyes and you walk past you know if you're like walking under a tree or whatever she's like um, when the sun goes in her eyes she gets really angry about it so I thought I'd get her some sunglasses for holiday um, these were 2 99 and then I also got these ones which were 5 99 these are blue ones I think I like the shape of these ones better and they have like softer more flexible sides so I feel like they'll be more comfortable for her um, but they came with the case so I'm actually going to pop both of them in the same case just for ease but yeah, she's got two pairs of sunnies, like a badass. Um, I don't actually know if they will fit in the same case, but I'm going to try. Yes, they will. There we go. Good to go. And then I also picked up a new sleeping bag for her because she is just growing out of the two sleeping bags that she has at the moment. Um, and she's got one other Aiden and Nay one that is like a thin, it's like a double layer muslin cloth um, sleeping bag. And this is a single layer for like yeah it's a single layer one so it's really really thin much better for the hot weather the ones that she's just grown out of are quite padded obviously she was a winter baby so um she had quite warm ones and then this is just so that she knows i feel like with with her in warmer weather she probably doesn't need a sleeping bag for like the heat like to stay warm but it's more so like she knows when she puts this on that it's bedtime and that she goes to bed um so yeah this is in age six to twelve months it was five pounds it wasn't even on the um in the clearance section which was five pounds it's from a brand called snf and it's organic cotton and it's a really nice print again this was from the boys section it's a really nice like whale and fish and it's turquoise um pretty pretty i like that a lot so that will be coming away with us on both trips and then lastly for the next stuff which is a whole big bag of stuff next are one of my favorite places to shop for baby clothes anyway i feel like at the moment they've just really nailed it for summer they've got so many cute things um the first thing oh, all the receipts on the floor that's fine the first thing i got was this little swimsuit which actually i bought i've this is the result of a few trips so some of the stuff is new new and other stuff i bought a couple of weeks ago which just hasn't worn it yet um and that is this is one of those things this is a little swimsuit again this is in six to twelve months i think i find with swimwear six to nine months i've got a couple of things that she's grown out of before she's even worn them that are three to six but they just don't fit her um so with all her swimwear stuff i've kind of sized up um because i had one that was a gift from my mum that she bought in three to six and she's just too big for it already um obviously it's been winter so she never got to wear it which made me really sad but i just thought this was absolutely adorable it's got um a little gingham 
It's like a little gingham navy swimsuit with a double kind of peplum frill and it's got the little scalloped edging and it's halter neck. She has also got um, part of the gap order that I made was one of those sun suits that has arms and legs so that she's like more out of the sun but I just thought that was a fun one as well. And then I also bought this cardigan which I got in six to nine months. I love this, it's so pretty and it was 11 pounds which I think was a really good price because it's really beautifully detailed. It's a knitted grey cardigan and it's got um, the most gorgeous detail on the sleeves if you guys can see. So pretty, it's almost like crochet on the sleeves and then it's got three little buttons on the front super cute absolutely love that and i think that will go with a lot of things in her wardrobe because a lot of her things are quite um neutral color wise i also picked up three pairs of new leggings from next um in six to nine months because all of her other ones are three to six or the primark ones are actually six to nine but they're a lot smaller so i got her black ones these are two pounds fifty each and i actually really like the detail they have of the little like lacy panel on, on the um, bottom seam, really cute. So I got those in black, in navy, and in white as well. So that should keep her covered legging wise for the next few months. And then lastly, I also got two rompers and these are probably my favorite things in this whole haul video. The first one is this linen romper, which was 13 pounds. And this is six to nine, but it'll definitely fit her now because it's quite on the smaller side of six to nine. How cute is this? It's like a really gorgeous muted khaki green and it's got white embroidery on the front there and it's a kind of short length one. So it comes like just where her nappy would come. So she's got her legs out. Um, and it's all ruched around the legs as well. It's got three poppers at the bottom, so it's easy to change. You could put this with like little shorts if you wanted, but I just think it looks super cute on its own. Um, adorable. Put it with a cardi if it gets a bit nippy in the evenings. I think she'll wear that a lot. And then lastly, this one's probably going to be just for the Portugal trip because it is on the bigger end of six to nine, so I don't know if she'll be in it for another couple of weeks. Um, because it is quite big. Rompers tend to look quite big. They look bigger than the dresses do anyway, but it's super cute. It's got um, illustrated uh, safari or like um, jungle animals on it, um, and it's got elasticated ruched neckline and arms, and then it's got the elasticated feet as well. Just thought this was really adorable. I think it was nine pounds, yeah super cute and very very lightweight it's a very thin cotton almost just like a t-shirt material but like a thin t-shirt so i think she'll be really comfy in this i feel like this is something that if she's to go down for like a nap or even if she could she could sleep in this it's that comfy like it's really soft the elasticated bits are really stretchy and i feel like because it's quite wide it'll be really comfy and she's got lots of kind of room to move around in it so i thought that was really cute i just love the illustrations too look at the elephant he's so cute elephant there's a giraffe there's a zebra there's a little baby i feel like it's a is it a baby leopard baby baby cheetah i don't know um super cute anyway so yeah that's her little romper and that is it for my summer baby haul lucky little bug has got some lovely things in her wardrobe to wear now she's grown out of a lot of her kind of um winter spring kind of crossover stuff and yeah i'm excited to stress her in all of them i hope you guys are having a great day and i will see you very soon bye